Round two of the Wisconsin Way Forums brought a room full of concerned citizens to the Waukesha County Technical College in July. They again shared their thoughts about how Wisconsin can change its tax structure to meet the challenges of the 21st century. The forum was the third in the second round of forums at which participants are reviewing potential policy solutions that were developed as a result of the first round of forums held last winter. And if you could comment a little more elaborate on that, I think that seems to be pretty important given all of the other money, and especially in light of the comment at the beginning about the strong feeling that there are players who are not paying their fair share. I think these are all some great ideas, but, you know, how, you know, how, how do we get the government to, you know, know we're serious and, and, and look at I don't think I need the mic, but I, I do think it's important if you want the um, university system to work with students to make sure they get done in four years, because when my daughter went to college, it was at UW-Eau Claire, and the first thing they said to us was, well, you know, to get the full college experience, she's going to probably need to be here five Have years. Have you picked up any feedback on the reduction on newspaper staffs, uh, cutting out uh, daily newspapers uh, in major areas of the state? Um, has that had any kind of effect on the thinking that you're getting from people? But to continue to keep in perspective millions and billions of dollars is really hard for me. To, to come to a good judgment about is that being used well or not. WEAC is one of the key Wisconsin Way partners, along with the Wisconsin Realtors Association, Wisconsin Counties Association, and Wisconsin Transportation Builders Association. Public Relations Executive James B. Wood of Wood Communications moderates the forums. He said leaders of the Wisconsin Way effort are currently working with a nonpartisan team of budget experts, policy advisors, and others to turn the public's priorities into a workable blueprint for the state. The blueprint will be presented to legislators, and Wood is optimistic they will work through their political differences to advance the agenda. Believe it or not, there are a lot of good people in the legislature who would like to solve problems and are unhappy about the fact that they're trapped in this kind of either or partisan sort of world. And so they are willing to, if we can produce a safe harbor for them, where we can bring the realtors on the one hand and we act on the other hand to the same point, it buys them a little bit of time to begin to engage in the conversation. The current round of statewide public forums continues through August 19th. For more information, go to weact.org slash Wisconsin Way.